Yes. Go. Let's talk about We're back trademark. on track. I love these guys. We've no, we actually known about them for a very long time. One a, a couple of years ago, we went to a networking event. I remember seeing them straight away because they were wearing these really flamboyant shirts, and there were these couple of dudes that were really cool. they were just looked adorable. Now these are like proper tradie shirts, but they've got designs that are like this all over. If you know what I mean, so they don't necessarily look like tradie shirts. Anyway. You should go check their website out. What's really cool about them is that they found it. Oh, and I should give a bit of a trigger warning now because we will mention suicide. So switch off if it's not your jam. Suicide and it's not one's jam. Some DV stats and yes, you know touchy, opinionated topics. stuff. So don't you know? And she can be really offensive. So I can't. She's the <laughs> offensive one. I'm the funny one. God. <laughs> anyway, let's talk about trademark. Mm. They founded the this company. Um, back in 2016, um, it was after one of the guys, so their names are Ed and Dan. One of Dan's friends took his own life, very tragically. He was very young. Um, so they actually started Trademark, which is colourful and functional gear, which you can see, um, for all tradies um, and workers. So they can look and feel great and in that way also reduce suicide rates. Because what they've also done is they've actually founded an entire new foundation called TX, which actually stands for This Is A Conversation Starter. Mm. And in each of their shirts, Lenny, if you will model for me, they actually have this way, yeah. So they've got, and this is a little bit, oh no, it's not backwards to you, but it actually literally says This Is A Conversation Starter on their shirts. So obviously, um, do you mind? Um, they want to start conversations about men's mental health. So what they did was they started this whole foundation where they um, you can ring in. It's a it's a let's see, they're born from trademark. It's Just a free and easy, sorry. Go on. What were you going to say? No, I was going to give you a moment to look for it because I yeah. was going to say in my mind, and this is totally stereotyping, but you would think of a tradie like this big tough guy mm-hmm. right that he doesn't have any problems and he should be able to sort out his problems right and, you know it's a wussy thing to do to talk about your feelings which it's not so I mean it's such a it's a no-brainer but why hasn't this been around before right like to help these guys that's right and I think yeah. that they obviously saw that they m- yeah. saw a point in the market that's like w- there's a, there's a lack here for men to feel comfortable calling up anything mm. reaching out for help you know what I mean so it kind of yeah. to me seems like they are very you know, charismatic and personable, these two guys. So it's almost like, you know, when you call TX, I feel like you're, kind of, you're calling a mate. You know, yeah. it's like you're calling for a, call for a yarn. Um, so TX, this is a conversation starter, obviously started by the trademark guys. Um, and they realised how many people were reaching out for mental health support without actually getting any. Mm-hmm. So this is a free and easy and direct mental health support. Um, you can call for free counselling or access their website for mental health information, essentially. Um, there's cool. also a couple of different stats that they had on their website that I'll just pull up because it's really cool, like, the amount of people they've managed to help just through this company that they started. I kind of feel like because it's, they started it from the ground up. It's cool to see what they've done. So 3,300, over 3,300 clients supported. So that's how many people would have um, called in the last couple of years, I think, since they founded TX. Um, 65% of those people were first-time callers to any kind of counselling. Yeah, or, see? Exactly. Because right? like the big burly, you know, yeah. I'm tough type of guy. Yeah. That's right. And also like where mm-hmm. did they find that information to begin with? It's kind of cool that this is directed at tradies. Yeah. Um, 2,400, more than 2,400 hours of conversations are funded, like have been funded. Oh, right. Okay. Um, a, more than 1,100 of callers refer to formal mental health care. So obviously I just feel like they're making waves, you know. Yeah. And look. Well, what's the money one? This just says 721000 more than uh, yeah. market value of services. So the total estimated right. equivalent market value of services provided to TX clients for free. Right. So they what they do is essentially they get a whole bunch of like different companies to try and obviously, you yeah. know, fund this project with them. So along with Trademark and different companies, they are able to find, fund free counselling for so obviously they're making a huge difference. Obviously they're making a huge yeah. difference. I think even if you were to help one person yeah. who didn't, who, who, you know, needed someone to call and they found someone to call, it's amazing. Yeah. Plus there's a fun little, this is my little fun fact. Oh. Linda Lynn, on your shirt, let yeah. me touch your boobie a little bit. Oh. On your shirt, there's a little, you see the little. Yeah. What it is says, that? It says. I keep hitting the it's mic. It's Y-N-W-A. Okay. And this is directly. For their friend who took his own life, again, Aww. tragically. Yeah. Because it means you will never walk alone. <gasps> Stop. So you'll never walk alone. 
Why NWA? I kind of fe- this is so beautiful to me. Yeah, because no, it's it is. men for men, yeah. and it's like they they obviously That's saw huge. that there was, you know, that there was a lack there. Yeah. So it's really cool that they've created this stuff so that so the men can start talking about it and talking yeah. about their feelings. Obviously, we all know women like to talk about their feelings. Hell, we like to talk about anything. <laughs> we talk, men, uh, we probably talk about them too much. To we talk about people, too much right? stuff. Yeah. But men don't get that. 